Good morning, uh, day five, <laughs> yay, of Lemtrada. I'm an outpatient at Southampton Hospital and it's day five. I had a really, really rough day yesterday. Day four was definitely the hardest by far. Um, I would say it was the itching. I wanted to rip my skin off. I felt so itchy and so uncomfortable. I don't know if you saw the video that I did at the end of day four yesterday. I felt so bad and so itchy um, and I've done Sudocrem, E45 cream, the lot, loads of stuff to try and uh, stop myself from scratching and itching but I felt just so uncomfortable um, and I felt low, I felt so so low, I felt like there was nothing left in me, I felt really really quite depressed um, and in a really dark place, like I don't know if I can get out of this, I don't know if I can ever feel normal again, it was just my insides felt like they were being burnt off, which technically they are, um, and there was nothing left in me to keep going. So I felt absolutely exhausted. I woke up this morning happy to uh, to be here and awake and alive. I thought, yes, okay, we can do this. It's the last day. Um, and then um, fainting. So I've always fainted quite a lot over the years. I don't know if it's multiple sclerosis related or not, to be perfectly honest. We've had loads of tests done for different things, but... Um, I get very lightheaded and fainty uh, when I'm under the weather and when I'm poorly and obviously in my body um, thinks it's under attack at the moment with this treatment and making me poorly. So I just felt so lightheaded so I've, um, I've managed to get myself in the car and the poor husband has literally done everything in the world this morning. And, uh, and now we're on the way to the hospital, but it is day five. They did say it will get harder the two days that you're not on the steroids because for two days, sorry, for three days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I've been on steroids, then Lemtrada, and then Thursday, Friday, yesterday and today, I'm just on the Lemtrada, so you haven't got the highs of the steroids to mask any of the, the negative feelings. Um, and boy, can you tell. So uh, anyway, trying to stay positive, and I am gonna keep smiling, and <laughs> I am gonna get through this. But it's tough, it's not been an easy ride, let's put it that way. But the good thing is, again, no, nothing anxious like pain. You're not uncomfortable, well, you are with the itching, but there's no actual pain or anything like that. It's just the emotional side of things, um, and your body is literally starting to shut down and think, you know, what are you doing to me? So, um, anyway, last day. Um, hopefully I'll get signed off later and then I'll be able to give you loads of information as to what we do next because I don't really know that either. Uh, the sun is blinding yet again but at least it's sunny and not raining. Okay, bye.